Warning, in this post-fight episode of Hydraverse Glitch, this will have spoilers, so turn away now. Let's just take a moment to appreciate how happy this team was and how much joy they had on their face and they didn't know what to do with themselves. It is completely refreshing to see the shock and awe and the sheer excitement that some teams can bring into the BattleBots even after all these years. I mean, yes, they're a rookie team, evident by this is how their bot looked every time we passed them in the pits. Completely ripped apart. But it's, it's amazing to be able to still see that kind of enjoyment. And for a lot of these bot builders, that's what it's all about. Because we're not making money, so <laughs> it's got to be something else in it for us. You could probably tell I was not a happy camper after this one. Not because we lost, but because the match started so good, and then it went all bad without us even touching the opponent. Now for the juicy stuff. Look at this one. Smoke again. Hydra, smoke, it's not looking good this season already. First it was the endgame pump controller burning out. Second match against Gruff, it was the big valve not firing. And this match was a gearbox. One of the planetary boxes on the drive, back right or back left, one of the sides, was locked up. And it burnt out the speed controller running it. So we were gimping along the whole match, which is okay for a certain extent because usually I don't move much anyway. Problem being, right here, yet don't flip into somebody else's weapon. And this is where everything else went wrong. Right there, they flip us over. Now I have to start self writing. And lo and behold, I self write directly nose diving into their weapon. That's usually not a good sign. But hey, other than the flipper tongue falling off, it still worked, I guess. It's shown to be able to take a hit now, even though we're upside down. It's probably the biggest hit we've taken so far in the three seasons. Of course, I can still keep the wedge generally pointed at them so they can't get any big hits on me. And of course, the way their bot just works, they really can't push too hard into me to get me up in there. So they, they do get the one big hit after the fact on the one corner because they're driving fast into me. But here's one big part of that whole drive scenario. What's the chance that I get counted out? And then in this clip right here, you don't see Hydra in the corner anymore. Where did I go? Well, it turns out the sprocket on the chain for that gearbox finally broke loose and allowed the wheel to free spin. So I drove back to my square. Man, this is just an unlucky season for us. One thing after another. So now that we have no chance of getting into the tournament, I guess it's going to be on a fusion to keep Team Wachi alive. As always, comment below what you think. And uh, if you have any other questions for us or want to see a different video on something else, make sure you tell us because we're not mind readers. And also, don't forget, the sponsors make the world go round. So if anybody else wants a sponsor, Feel free, message us. You know, we're not going to bite hard. <laughs>